Hi, I'm sommelier Leslie Miller from the Sip Better Wine Club, bringing you more tips and tricks for your holiday and entertaining season. Speaking of seasons, we're in one of my favorites. I call it the PSL season, pumpkin spice latte season. Doesn't it feel like everywhere you go, it's pumpkin this and pumpkin that? Pumpkin coffee, pumpkin bread, pumpkin fruit, all kinds of flavors out there with pumpkin. The beer and the wine category is full of them, but I'm here to give you some alternative grapes and wines to pair to all those things fall right now. All right, let's start with one of my favorite grapes on the shelf. Yes, I'm a true Pinotphile. I love Pinot Noir because it is the grape that kind of pairs to everything. I call it the get out of jail free grape because you can serve Pinot in a lot of scenarios and it will pair to almost everything. I've picked up the Knutson Vineyards, a very small family winery that sits in the middle of the Willamette Valley that I adore. Their Pinot Noirs are absolutely world class. Lots of that beautiful spice depending on the vintage and lots of that big vibrant fruit that will actually go with things like mushrooms, stuffings, actually all the way through to leafy greens, uh, all kinds of great squashes. So Pinot, don't forget about it. Um, speaking of reds, if you like those light bodied reds, I'm going to suggest a grape for you that might be new to your repertoire. It's called Schiava. Schiava is grown in Northern Italy in a region called Trentino Alto Arge. Schiava is great for those dishes where you're gonna have lots of like warm fennel spices. Also like that sausage and mushroom stuffing that you're gonna make this year for your holiday season. Schiava is kind of the best grape for it. Also broccoli smothered in cheese, look out, Schiava's coming for you. All right, as we head into the greens category, I like to take acid and acid together. So I'm gonna recommend Sauvignon Blanc, specifically from the region of Sancerre in the Loire Valley of France. This Sauvignon Blanc is super snappy, wicked acidic, and almost gives you kind of this bright kiss of citrus right off the edge that is really kind of cool in the sense of pairing to kale, spinach, broccoli, things that have a kind of like tart green um, sort of snap to them. So that acid on acid work really well. Are you that person that heads into the ham area when it comes to your holiday season? No turkey for you. You like to grill up some ham or even bake ham? Then Syrah is also a fantastic grape for all these pairing ideas. This is Crow's Hermitage from the family uh, of Gigal, and they do a really nice job in Northern Rhone. A little bit beefy, so you might wanna actually roast your ham um, with kind of like a maple glaze on the outside if you're gonna pair to something from the Rhone Valley. And of course, I'm gonna tell you to never leave rosé behind. Just because we're heading into cooler seasons does not mean that you need to ditch the pink. This is the Grapes Weigelt, and you know me, I love Austrian rosés. They're fresh, they're clean, they're dry, and this Weigelt has all the right fruit to get you through every single dish that's gonna be on your table this pumpkin spice latte season. All right, send in all of your questions if you have more when it comes to pairing ideas, and we'll bring them to you. Thanks for joining.